The Reading Road Trip is all about getting books into the heads of kids, but of course, first you have to get books into the hands of kids. Yeah, and England Elementary has started <laughs> a brand new initiative to do just that. THV 11's Jordan Howington tells us about a vending machine bringing plenty of excitement. Jordan. Absolutely. So, no, the students don't get to pick which candy bar they want for a snack, but something much healthier for their brains, which is a book. Yeah. Awesome. The vending machine is a new fun way to get kids to read and boost their scores. It's awesome. It's safe to say if they didn't have the book vending machine, we, they all, none of this would be happening right now. The newest addition to England Elementary has caused quite the buzz. What we're hoping is it'll encourage them to read more books. The Wheelberry Garden. That's what I think this book's going to be about. Kids in Miss Lanehart's second grade class. First time. Are on their best behavior in hopes of a trip to the book vending machine. It's not your traditional library, but one that's more interactive for students. The books here, you don't get to keep them. You have to keep them at school but these you can take home. A trip to the vending machine only costs one of these gold tokens, and children can get one by having good behavior. They come to the machine, put it in, just like it would be a candy machine. You pick out your letter and your number, and um, they get to pick out whichever book they, they want. Lanehart says many students school-wide are struggling in reading, and this newest initiative falls in line with the state's push to increase reading scores. Seems like we're always pushing them up to the to go up to the next reading level, and here it's more of not just what level your book is, but just to grab a book and to actually enjoy reading it. Miss Lanehart gave Ava Livingston her first gold coin. She picked the book Bailey's Story. Well, I wanted to see how the book would go, if it's better than the movie or if the movie's better. Each week, staff will hand out 60 coins to students. That's 60 books in the hands of kids eager to read another chapter. The joy, the excitement on those kids is you know, on their face. It just it tells it all. Awesome. So what's even more awesome about this is the students raised money to get the vending machine and they are a Title I school. So the Title I funding is what keeps the vending machine stocked with books oh. of all kinds. Amazing. I loved it. It was so, so exciting. cool. Well, and we hope the novelty it's not just because it's well, novel, get it, novelty. <laughs> anyway, we hope it's, there's more to it than just novelty, that, that yep. this is a lasting impression that yep. they'll have. It's something that they'll always remember. <laughs> and the little girl that I spoke with that you, you guys saw in the story, she was like, this was my first token. This is the first book that I've gotten <laughs> to choose. And she was so excited about it. So it's something that she'll... She's, Remember. she's headed to drama class. Oh, she is. A big personality. Yep. Big personality. She deserves every bit of that. Yeah. Yeah. That's exciting, though. Yeah. It's awesome. I wish I had something like that when I was in school. That's what I was telling the kids. I was like, you know what? Take advantage of this because we did not have anything cool like this. Yeah. When I one was in, in the school. break room. Yeah. <laughs> Craig's going to pop out of one on one of his <laughs> Around here, I think trips. more people are looking for the candy bars <laughs> yeah, at this point. I, I would have been like, where, where's the Snickers? <laughs>